I didn't know this was real rappers. Oh, yeah, this is Joe. I Robert. thought this was just somebody about to get. Oh, nah, feel me? Yo, gang, feel me? We back with another video. We got Bronx rappers and ops caught lacking. Feel me? Hit the like button, the subscribe button. Yeah, I already know the vibes, man. Let's get it. It's wild. With all the beef going down in the city, ops catch each other all the time. If you ain't moving smart, it's only a matter of time before you get caught in a bad situation. Today, we're breaking down Bronx rappers and ops who got caught lacking. K Flock is locked up on Rico and murder charges right now, but he was becoming the face of Bronx drill before he got booked. His music was popping off like crazy, but he was always making headlines for spinning the block and looking for ops on IG Live. Flock ain't just rap about the streets, he was actually in the trenches. He came up in a crazy area of the Bronx called Sevside, and the set he reps has major beef with another crew called the YGs. The YGs are one of the most hated sets in the city, but they got a lot of rappers putting in work in the booth. One of their hottest artists was a dude named Ra G's. Back in the day, you would just go do your dirt and move on, but now ops can hop on social media and send shots online. K Flock and Ra were always sending threats back and forth, and they even hop on IG Live together to diss each other. Flock wasn't just gonna keep it online though. According to the police, K Flock and other dudes from Sev Side and Third Side were shooting up the city all the time between 2019 and 2022. They claimed that Sev and Third Side linked up to terrorize the Bronx, and Flock was allegedly neck deep in the trenches with them. K Flock went live on Instagram and spun the YG's block to let everyone know how serious he was about the beef. Flock pulled up to their hood in broad daylight to show how comfortable he was, and the crazy part is, nothing happened to him. The comments said, quit, quit talking to strangers. <laughs> hood in broad daylight to show how comfortable he was and the crazy part is nothing happened to him right after flock pulled up to his ops hood rod g's hop on live and challenge him to come back somebody attack a flock nigga niggas not playing him come right back fuck niggas outside right now as we speak you coming through hot and all live blocking niggas off your lives so niggas can't see your shit like what's up pop out nigga we outside here yeah. okay flock pop out what happened next prove you should be careful what you wish for though after they went back and forth on live, a video came out showing some of Flock's homies allegedly chasing Rod down the street. Then oh. Flock aired him out for letting them spin his block with no consequences. Y'all never told me about that video. We never knew about K Flock chasing, chasing out Rod. Quinces on the track Power and rapped, Ra Ra, he saw me, he ain't let it clap. Like, ask him how much I threw back. I'm a demon. I like to react. Ra clapped back on the track Real Facts and said, Hey, okay, K, now let's talk the facts. Anytime that they threw, I threw back. And D-O-A-K, catch a flocker, he flopped. And Lil' K-K, that boy know my bop. Why is you lying? You know I threw shots. Had y'all niggas ducking on y'all tops. It didn't look like anyone actually took shots at Flock when he was in YG's territory, but that's not the only time he spun their block on live. One time, he slipped through the YG's hood with C-High Watts and some other dudes. They saw an op walking down the street, and that's when Flock hop out the whip and try to run him down. He right, he right there, he right there, he right there. Where, where? He right there. Don't run! Don't run, nigga! Yo, fuck it, Johnny, fuck him! Fuck him! Flock caught his ops slacking on IG Live, but this next dude ran down on the ops while a whole camera crew was following him. Shy E.K. is one of the hottest rappers in the Bronx right now. He's known for sending wild disses at everyone, even his old homies. He came up in the Corlin projects and reps the OGs. But back in the day, he was cool with K Flock and Dougie B before street politics got in the way. Vice I thought it was gonna be videos of niggas getting caught, like, I did too. getting body slammed or some shit. Snooze was shooting an episode with Shaw one day when he had court. Most rappers wouldn't crash Shaw when they're being recorded for a documentary. But when Shaw spotted his ops outside the courthouse, hey, so Stop running! Yo, stop running! The cops jumped in to break it up before anything serious went down. But Shaw made it clear that he was ready to throw down anytime and anywhere. People outside the city don't understand why you'd be fighting in front of the courthouse. But Sha told Cam Capone news that it happens all the time. But how did that happen in front of the police, in front of the courthouse? That was in front of the courthouse. That shit happened every day. Really? Any day, Monday to Friday in the courthouse, that's what happened. So it's every really day. like on time. If I see you, it's on time. Because everybody catching cases, so everybody getting the same court day. And you don't even know. So once you go there, you see one of your ups. Shaw also said if you want to catch somebody lacking, the courthouse makes it easy. Oh, niggas be posting... Wish me good luck at court. Once you do that, our block is right there. So only place you can see them is 161 on the calls. And now we can face them. That's, that's what just happened.
getting recorded by Vice while fighting your ops is wild. But Shaz felt himself putting hands on them too. Take everything out. Take everything out. Just give me Ewok. Ewok, stupid. Grab him. Grab him. Grab him. Let's deep. You were just screaming Trilly! Why are you screaming Trilly? I wasn't screaming Trilly! Oh, oh, drop it! Oh, oh, drop it! Oh, oh. Getting pressed like that on camera was bad enough, but what Shaw did to another op was way more embarrassing. Shaw posted a video of himself walking up to a whip with a dude sitting inside next to his mom. It's not clear who the other dude is, but Shaw told him, Stop saying you OG's K, nigga. Where am I? Stop saying you OG's K. If I slap shit out, you worried about my mother, nigga. Shaw's op wouldn't even look up at him or say anything, and it was clear he didn't want no <laughs> nigga. <laughs> <laughs> nigga started rolling at the window, bro. But he looked like a little ass kid. Though. Look no, you worried about my mother, nigga? Shaz op wouldn't even look up at him or say anything, and it was clear he didn't want no this smoke. Though, What's like... really wild about Shah E.K. is that he was still going to school, and since the ops knew where he was, made the situation sketchy for him. He caught a lot of ops lacking on camera, but one time he was the one who got caught. You must be out of you pussy. What? Come on, you know what I'm right? <laughs> Pop Smoke put the wolves on the map for people outside of the city, but a duel from their rivals, the Trolls, went viral for catching an op lacking on IG Live. Freshy the General is a troll affiliated rapper who was chilling on the block and went live on IG. Everything was cool at first, but when his homie spotted an op named Quay, Freshy took off running at him and screaming. Nope. Nope. <laughs> That's Quay. Yo, we on it. What about my money? 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 What about Why money? What about my money? What about his neck What about my money? 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 What about <laughs> they weren't able to catch up to the dude, but Freshie was obviously ready to stomp him out on camera. But when you moving like that, there's always a chance you'll end up on the wrong side oh of the beat. And that's exactly what he happened. Lucky he got away. See, like he should have ran track. He probably did until he got out of school. But he should have stayed in the school and ran track. You can see his ability, bro. Yeah, but like, the nigga's fast as he shit. He didn't have no guidance. Freshy had beef with a dude named Owen BJD, and JD ended up catching him lacking. JD recorded Freshy walking down the street by himself right and said he could be I in a split right now it. if JD really wanted to do something. Freshy clapped back and said JD wasn't going to do anything except post on IG, and that turned out to be a huge mistake. JD let him go the first time, but Freshy wasn't so lucky the second time it happened. JD and his homies caught Freshy in the street and handed him a brutal oh, beatdown. They dragged him across the, the concrete, then embarrassed him even more by giving him a wedgie like a little kid. Set the Trend is a Bronx drill rapper mm. who's tight with K Flock. But while Flock is famous for sliding on ops on live, Set went viral last year after getting caught lacking on video. Set like, after you get dragged by your drive on, on camera, what you supposed to do? <laughs> they still be dissing back. They still be saying, God, How do you diss somebody? God got boomed. They God got, be, got. They, you got boomed. Mm -hmm. Like, you, how do you still drag somebody and you got dragged? By your draws on the concrete. That's oh, what I. That's what I'd be saying. I'd be acting like. Like, how do you? I don't. I would never even go back outside. I would go back to school. Like that one rapper. I would go back to high school. Like that one rapper that. Was, the one that was under that <laughs> table with them shoes. He ain't on. make a song yet. He better not. That's what I like. That's what I yeah, like. Yeah, I like when they get quiet. I, I like Cause that. you could not talk more shit after you got yeah. dragged or you got. Yeah, this movie. You was running. You cannot do that. Niggas got burnt. Oh, homie. Running different. Maybe if you was on the way home to take care of baby mama some food or something. Yeah, fuck. No, I'm saying I'll let you slide for running. You had somewhere to be. Somebody was waiting for you. Oh, because the baby mom, you, know, you need some your food. Your baby, you feel me? It's some... And you running to get there? Yeah. They don't give a fuck. I know. Them niggas gonna record you. <laughs> <laughs> See, nigga. And, oh, they, yeah. and they might take that plate. No Whatever plate you got for your food, McDonald's and all that, they might take that shit. We're sliding on ops on live. But you got to see this one, though. This one right across the I've already seen it. Creep, this one. Then embarrass him even more by giving him a wedgie. He, he, he still be rapping. 
like a little kid. I will stop listening. Set the trend is a Bronx drill rapper who's tight with K Flock. But while Did Flock he, is famous for. Sliding on Ops on live, Set went viral last year after getting caught lacking on video. Set the trend has beef. Actually, the nigga that did it to him, they saying allegedly that he he telling right now, which is crazy. He's in jail too. I think for like seven he's years. They saying he's snitching. I hope he's not though. They saying he's with snitching. the YGs. And last year, one of two two G's homies, Key Herbo, allegedly pressed him on camera. You know who that is, right? Probably if you tell me his name. All right. It's a song that we listen to, and when his part come up, you be like, turn that shit off. Don't play. Um, K.E. Herba, mm -hmm. who is this? That's Haitian brother, right? Uh. Mm -hmm. I said went viral last year after getting caught lacking on video. Wait, that's K.E. Herba? Mm-hmm. Haitian oh brother, you always be like, yo, turn his shit off. <laughs> and that's his damn song. He didn't tell us. Tran has beef with name. the YGs, mm -hmm. and last year, one of 2-2-G's homies, Key Herbo, allegedly pressed him on camera. A video came out showing Set looking uncomfortable while some dudes off camera are calling someone pussy. Yeah. He be talking, pussy, boy. He be talking. Yeah. Pussy, boy. Yeah. 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 It's not clear exactly what was going down that night, but Key Herbo posted another video where he was allegedly on the phone with Set the Trend talking about the situation. It sounds like Key Herbo was trying to throw hands, but Set didn't want to get jumped. Why when I told you let's fight, you ain't want to fight though, gang? Watch what you mean, nigga. I told you one on one. Said the trend clapped back and said they was all just clout chasing. He wasn't going to give it to him. I'm trying to get that clout up because I'm not giving y'all no clout. I dirty black motherfuckers. Said also went viral a few months back for spinning on his old homie C Blue on live. C Blue and Set were all good back in the day. But after they started sending shots back and forth on social media, Set the trend went looking for him on the block. He didn't catch him on live, but Set allegedly smashed up C Blue's whip. And that's when C Blue went live too and tried to track him down. Nothing serious ended up happening, but if they still have beef, it's probably only a matter of time before it pops off again. A lot of rappers. Yeah. I thought they were about to show me. I thought they were trying to show me yeah. some, some good shit. I know everything that already just happened with this one. I thought it was some new shit. Well, I knew most of it. And I don't even be, be knowing this yeah. shit. Yeah. Me putting you onto the shit. Yeah. But yo, gang, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. Fake niggas, we don't do those. Fake niggas, we don't do those. Hardcore, hardcore. Weirdos, weirdos.